Today, I'll be showing you guys how to do your Hotbit taxes with Coinly. Welcome back to another video. Today, I will be showing you guys, as I mentioned, how to do your crypto taxes if you have the Hotbit wallet, obviously with the assistance of Coinly. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about the wallet itself. Then I'm gonna jump into the integration part of the video for this one. Pretty straightforward, there's no API, so we're gonna need some CSV files and you might need to do some manual imports. Uh, I'll show you how to do all that, that's not an issue. Then I'm gonna show you how to get the necessary tax documentation, which is very easy with Coinly. And then lastly, if you have any questions, if you have you know people you need to talk to from our community, I'll leave some resources for you. But without further ado, let's jump into today's video. So Hotbit was founded in 2018 and is based out of Zug, Switzerland. Currently, it is just on the outskirts of top 100 exchanges by trading volume. Um, and although they have a re relatively beginner friendly interface, I would say, they also offer services for more experienced traders um, like you know ETFs and stuff like that. So Hotbit is the largest exchange in terms of coins supported. Their investment tab offers over 500 different projects you can invest in. There is obvious downsides to that. There can be potential scams on there from time to time. So make sure to research everything that you invest in. Okay, so let's talk about the integration part of this video. First, you're gonna sign into Coinly, head over to the wallets tab, and then you're gonna click add wallet. We're gonna find the Hotbit wallet, and there it is. As you can see, the API, the auto sync is currently in beta, so we're gonna ignore it. We're only interested in importing CSV files. Okay, so we're here on the Hotbit Exchange. In the top right corner, we have an orders uh, button, which we're gonna click on. And here are you know all the trades I've made, just demo ones. And you can select a time frame that's appropriate for your needs. So whether that's you know a week, a month, or an entire tax year. For me, since this account is only like a, a couple days old, I've selected a week. So here it shows you the trades. However, it does not show you withdrawals and deposits. So you will have to add those manually, unfortunately, um, but that shouldn't be too difficult. I've made content on that, which I will leave in the top right corner of this video. Okay, so once you're done that, you're gonna click the export button. Now there's one thing to note here. Um, you're, you're gonna get a outdated version of Excel. And once you import that file, it actually won't work with Coinly. So there's one additional step, which is not too difficult. You're gonna download that file. You're gonna go and open it in, I don't know, Google Spreadsheets, which is free. Uh, and it will look something like this. And then you're gonna click File, Download, and Comma Separated Values. You're gonna export it as a CSV file. Okay, so pretty straightforward. Just the one additional step. And then you're gonna take that CSV file and drag and drop it into Coinly and click import and you should have no problems and there you go. So if we go back to our wallet, here you can see some of the transactions I've made and the cryptocurrencies I'm dealing with. Okay, so from here on out, it's pretty straightforward. We're gonna head over to the tax reports area where you will get a summary of your transactions, deposits, withdrawals. Remember, if, if you need to import withdrawals and deposits with Hotbit, um, you'll have to do that manually. Um, and here's a great area where you can kind of monitor your activity throughout the year to see where your uh, crypto taxes are going to end up. And then at the very bottom, you can select the necessary tax document depending on which country you are from. And we have many different kinds of tax documents. So for the US, we have the IRS Schedule D Form 8949. You can also export TurboTax both online and desktop version. Uh, we have reports for the UK, Sweden, Norway, France, Switzerland, Australia. And then lastly, for Canada and Germany and other countries, we have the complete tax report. And this is also a document you can give directly to an accountant and they can combine it with other tax documents. And then lastly, um, you know, if you'd like to invite the accountant to our platform to set up their accountancy firm, you can do that. And also make sure to check to see in your country if these tax reports are deductible. It is a service that helps you with your taxes. So depending on where you're from, it might be deductible. And that brings us to the conclusion of this video. So here we have some links I'll leave down below. Here is the Coinly Help Center. We have countless articles on crypto tax related uh, topics. Then we have a forum section where you can talk to members of our community as well as our staff. And then lastly, if you'd like to send us a direct message or an email, we'd be happy to get back to you and assist you in any way that we can. But if you enjoyed this video, if you found it helpful in any way, consider dropping a like, subscribing for more crypto content, and I'll see you next time. Peace.